So this is my grandmother's step and as you can see it desperately needs a new coat of paint so I'm going to take a scraper and I'm going to start scraping You're gonna that. Paint anything, you might as well take a scraper and just scrape off all the old paint because if you don't what will end up happening is the paint will start to lift and actually come off a lot quicker than it needs to. So we're just going to scrape all this excess stuff off before we start the paint. So we're still scraping the paint and as you notice if you, uh, you apply some elbow grease it will come off. So you just want to scrape it all off and then you can start the paint. And I'm not actually going to scrape the lattice because lattice is so cheap that I could probably find some in heavy pickup that I can just replace if I need if it doesn't cover so well. And I am using interior instead of exterior and the reason I'm doing that is because it was free paint. A friend of mine gave it to me and somebody told me that you can do it and it'll last at least a year. And what is on it right now doesn't look very good so anything would look better than what's on it. So I'm just going to start painting and I'll bring it back. So this is what the step looks like without the paint and I just started painting that corner. That's where I'm going to start. That's my vocal point. And I'm going to keep an update too to see how well the uh, interior holds up and on the outside. As you can see, it's uh, definitely starting to look different. I'm just going to uh, fast forward and show you what it looks like. Once so I just wanted to done. show contrast of what the blue looks like wow. compared to what the white looks like. And as you can see, the white is definitely a lot cleaner. And I'm just going to continue to paint and I'll bring it back. So I just wanted to show a little update of what it's looking like. Uh, my buddy Brad over there is painting. That's whose arm you see right there. Um, so yeah, we're just going to continue to paint. And uh, we'll bring it back and show you what it looks so like. So you can see I got the uh, pretty well the front of it all all whitened up there on that section. And I'm working on the stairs. Still have to do the blue there. I'm just leaving it there just to... Uh, show you the contrast of how great it looks. Now remember this is interior paint and we are using it on the exterior and I'm going to track to see how long it stays. But when you don't really have money to buy supplies, you'll use whatever you can. So I'm just going to continue to paint. You I'll can see you I have like. almost the whole front done. I didn't do the stairs yet because uh, obviously um, I'm going to wait till I don't have as many little helpers out here. As you can see, the lats are broke and stuff, but I don't really have the money to replace them, so I'm just going to paint them. That's what I did over there. I'm just going to be very careful and do uh, what i got to do and make this uh, project a little bit better. So, well, there's my some updates house, tomorrow. And there's all the garbage that we put out. And I just wanted to show you that there's a whole bunch of it. So, watch for ups updates. I'll show you the other side in a minute. The uh, tree stumps have been... Uh, well, the baby trees where they were coming up were cut down with a uh, circular saw because they were getting way too thin, or too thick, I mean. So, we're just going to start with this. So, I'm going to head out and paint the step. I'm going to just show a little video of uh, the drive out just to show how beautiful it is today. And for anybody that's worried that I'm doing this by driving, I'm the passenger. So, never ever try to like drive down the road holding a video or whatever because you might kill somebody. And it's not worth it. That's the highway. I just wanted to show that a lot of houses are having the uh, heavy garbage uh, pickup and it's good that the city does that because it gives uh, homeowners the chance to get rid of all that uh, stuff that the garbage man normally doesn't take that's too big and that's why my nanny's house has so much stuff. Today I don't get a sunburn. Let's check it out. I just wanted to show the other side of the house so you can see where it's been painted and that's all the garbage. But I'm not going to feel bad because every house has garbage and we're cleaning out a house after a death so there's going to be lots of garbage. So 
not feeling bad. So I'm just gonna two of the project. Show you I'm gonna do half the stairs and I'm just gonna do half of them right now just to leave access to go up and down. Instead of having to go all the way around the house. And I'm just gonna uh, continue painting it and I'll bring it back. Just wanted show to show that I have half the step almost done. And we're just having a little feed here. We have the barbecue right here. We're barbecuing up some wieners, some burgs. I just checked out the burgs. Mm, they look delicious. Can't wait to eat them. And we're gonna work on the uh, rest of the we have all the little stuff out here for a burger with a table here that uh, we brought outside. There's no reason not to. I enjoy just wanted a to take day. a quick little video of that. We're still on day two, and uh, I'm just gonna finish up uh, the other corner over there. And that and corner's done now. So what we're gonna do now is we're gonna work on the top part of it, which is we're gonna sweep off the step, make sure there's no dust, just to uh, get it all clean and fresh. Then we're gonna you paint see, the step. I'm finally out of the first can, and I just wanted to show that I uh, started the uh, second half of the uh, step. So. I'm just going to uh, get the other can. I'm gonna start to do some painting and uh, I'll bring you back. Probably gonna have to do day three of painting because I'm on day two and it's almost seven o'clock, so probably don't have much okay. daylight left. That was $51 a gallon. Good thing my friend gave it to me.